This educational video is based on the title of powder diffraction and Scherer equation. At first, what is crystallite? Crystallite is a small crystal. It could be made of many atoms or molecules. Crystalline size is smaller than grain size. XRD diffractogram can be used to calculate crystalline size using Scherer's formula. What is grain? Grain made up with crystallites. Grain combine to form particles. Both grain and crystallite are single crystals. Transmission electron microscope, TEM, can be used for measuring grain size. Next, what is particle? Particle is an agglomerate, small enough in size, to not consider as a thin film or a bulk, but comprised of two or more crystallites. Particle also made up with grains. The size of particle is the largest, followed by the grain size, and the crystalline size is the smallest among three of them. What is Scherer equation? The Scherer equation in X-ray diffraction and crystallography is a formula that relates the size of submicrometer crystallite in a solid to the broadening of a peak in a diffraction pattern. It is often referred to, incorrectly, as a formula for particle size measurement or analysis. It is named after Paul Scherer. It is used in the determination of size of crystals in the form of powder. How to write the formula of Scherer equation? The formula is, d, equal to k multiply with lambda, and divided by beta cos theta. d, is average crystallite size, k, is Scherer constant, lambda, is the x-ray wavelength, beta, is the line broadening at fwhm in radians, and theta, is the Bragg's angle in degrees, half of 2 theta. It was developed in 1918. The shape factor of k can be 0.62 to 2.08 and is usually taken as about 0.89. It is only applicable for small things such as crystallite, but not applicable for grain or particle. What is the function of Scherer equation? This equation is used to calculate the nanocrystallite size by XRD radiation of wavelength lambda, from measuring full width at half maximum of peaks in radian, located at any 2 theta in the pattern. Lastly, what is full width at half minimum, FWHM? FWHM, gives an estimate of the diffracting domain size in the chosen, 110, or, 111, plane. A less broadened peak will be obtained, if some bigger crystal sizes are used. Field Emission Scanning Electron Microscopy, FESEM, or, High Resolution Transmission Electron Microscope, HRTEM, analysis is required to estimate the particle size. The FWHM, of XRD profiles is used, to characterize different material properties and surface integrity features. Thank you for watching our video.